Knights Climb. This is for our Battalion Chief, Dennis Cross. He was on Battalion 57, Bedford Stuyvesant, area of Brooklyn. This is his 110, finishing his footsteps, getting him to the top. This is the 69th climb of the 343 commitment. Yes, sir. I've got pants and my jacket on, along with the blast mask. So in seven verticals, and about uh, nine floors, Battalion Chief Dennis Cross will be sitting at the top. Got about 30 seconds before the first vertical hits. And then it's on. All the way to the top. First vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Krauss, Battalion 57, Bedford Stuyvesant, Section of Brooklyn. This climb is to honor respect. Battalion Chief Krauss's 37 year career with the FDNY. His last assignment was on Battalion 57. He did not want to sit behind a desk and do paperwork. So he took over a few opportunities and went from a captain, which they called him Captain Fearless, to Battalion Chief, Battalion 57 where he was last seen in the South Tower rescuing others before the South Tower collapsed. This is to pay honor to the ultimate sacrifice made by Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. Back side of that first vertical. One of his sayings that Battalion 2 Cross has was take care of your men, and your men are going to take care of you. It's very true. So this is my way of honoring him, carrying him to the top. So this climb, as I said before, is for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. His father was in the FDNY. I died of a heart attack, fighting a fire, when Battalion Chief Cross was only 13 years old. Battalion Chief Cross and his widow, Joanne, were married 37 years together. Within his 37 year career in the FDNY. Battalion Chief Cross was a Vietnam veteran, fought in service to his country, and came back and got on with FDNY.
He has a son, Ryan. I believe his last name is also going to be Cross, who's a New York City firefighter. Your father will never be forgotten. Joanne, your husband, will never be forgotten. Chief Cross said he wanted to have a 50-year career in the FDNY. Be longer than anyone who's been there. He was shooting for 50 before 9-11. 2001 changes everything. This is to pay honor and respect to Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Bedford Story Bus in Brooklyn, and the ultimate sacrifice so that others may live. Second vertical, here we go. Second vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Battalion 57. He was out of the Bedford Stuyvesant area of Brooklyn. This is the fourth climb of this 48 hour tour so far. And the 69th climb of the 343 commitment. Working that way towards 75 brothers going up. I'm taking your brother up right now, Billy. Chief Cross is heading to the top. Right now. With honor and respect, I'm carrying him up. So his legacy will never be forgotten. Nor will any of the brothers be forgotten. So this is for Battalion Chief, Dennis Cross, out of Battalion 57. Coming down the second half, second vertical. Getting closer to that third milestone of 75 brothers at the vertical. 110 floors. So, for our brother, Battalion Chief, Dennis Cross, out of Bedford, Stuyvesant area of Brooklyn. This client pays honor and respect to his service to our nation and the sacrifice given on 9-11 where he was working in the South Tower and part of the greatest rescue effort in the history of the U.S. with efforts of 25,000 saved because of the bravest. So this is carrying him up to the symbolic 110 where everybody goes when it's time to go to the top. We finish their footsteps because they climbed before us. We take them all the way to that top and they never quit what they were doing. So we definitely will never quit in this effort to honor and pay respect to the 343 brothers lost on 9-11-2001. Be up on the third vertical shortly. 
of the 343 climb for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Battalion 57. Coming up on number three, out of seven. And off we go. So this is the 343 Commitment Climb, 110 floors, 2,420 stairs for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Battalion 57, to pay honor and respect to the legacy of Battalion Chief Cross for his service to our country and service to the citizens of New York City for 37 years. He wanted to make it 50, and he did everything within his power, whether it be running, lifting weights, bike riding. He wanted to make sure he was able to make that commitment fulfilled for the 50 years. He was 37 years with his wife, Joanne, had several kids, which his son, Brian, also followed in his footsteps, which ran in the family of being part of FDNY. Chief Cross's father was FDNY. Of course, Chief Cross was FDNY, and his son is FDNY. So this is in tribute to honor and respect his legacy. When he was a captain, they called him Captain Fearless because he wasn't afraid to go in and join his brothers on the inside of a fire. He was inside with them, just like at the World Trade Center. He was in the South Tower getting it done, rescuing as many as they could before the South Tower came down. So here we go, finish the third vertical, moving towards that fourth. Seven total, and about eight or nine floors. Hey Mark. So, This memorial climb is for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. To his wife, Joanne, your husband's sacrifice will never be forgotten. He will always be remembered in our hearts, on our minds, and personally, on my shoulder, where I wear that number 343, out of honor and respect for the brothers who lost on 9-11-2001. Like I said before, take care of your men, and your men are take care of you, was one of Italian two crosses, same. And it's very true by what he said. So this is his continuation of his footsteps, carrying him to that 110, to that summit, where 68 other brothers are waiting on him within the 343 commitment, as this is the 69th climb towards that 75. Coming up on the fourth vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. This is dedicated to the FDNY, both off and on the line, to Battalion 57 and the House of the Bedford Stuyvesant, 
head to the family. I'll be talking to Dennis Cross, Joanne, his daughter, and his son Brian. My brother, your husband, your father will never be forgotten. His legacy will carry forth for years to come. His serving his country in the Vietnam era. Coming back and joining the FDNY and putting in 37 years of which he wanted to put in a total of 50. He will not be forgotten. As soon as I get the second part of this fourth vertical done, I'll give you a floor count, Mark. Each step that's climbed is another step towards another floor. 110, and it's another brother to that top. So that's symbolic top of the tower. This is to make sure our brothers are never forgotten. Pushing it to the top. This is for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. And this right now is 58 floors. Three more verticals, about nine floors. Good evening, Joan. Just trying to make a difference. Keeping our village memories alive. So, this is for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Battalion 57, Bedford Slave Mission Area of Brooklyn. This is the 343 Commitment Climb to which each brother going to be carried 110 all the way to the top one at a time until 343 reach the vertical fourth climb of this tour 69th climb so far down to 274 brothers left to carry vertical Thanks, John. So we got three verticals left and about nine floors. It's a long-term commitment, but every brother has their legacy and a story that will be told. So here comes that. Fifth vertical. Fifth vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. Battalion 57, Bedford Stoy Vessant area of Brooklyn. He will not be forgotten. His legacy will be carried forth. That's the commitment made with the 343 commitment. Our brothers are not just a photo, not just a badge number. They have a story to tell. And each story will be accounted for. In service to his country and to the citizens of New York, 
Battalion Chief Dennis Cross had a 37 year career to which he wanted a 50 year career but it was interrupted by 9-11 and there were rescue efforts made by all of our bravest the last place he was working was the South Tower trying to rescue as many people as he could before the tower collapsed. He will never be forgotten. Coming down that backside of the fifth vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. Got two more verticals and a few floors for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. All right. Open it up just a tiny bit. It's hot in here. said before, Battalion Chief Dennis Cross had a 37 year career, which he wanted to be 50. So to keep up, he would run, work out, lift weights, and do everything he could do to keep his body in shape because he wanted to be the one with 50 years on of FDMY. His father died of a heart attack when he was only 13. He joined the Upton Y, carrying his father's torch. And his son, Brian, is carrying his torch. It was a New York City firefighter. Joanne, your husband and his legacy and his life will never be forgotten. His sacrifice made was so that others may live. He was part of the greatest rescue effort in United States history. For this, we pay honor and respect. So this is his climb. Battalion Chief, Dennis Cross. Battalion 57, FDMI, Bedford Stoy Basin area. Second to last vertical coming up. Here's my second to last vertical for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. Battalion 57. To pay honor and respect to the life and legacy of Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. Pay respect for his service to our country. Going out, fighting in Vietnam, coming back, and starting a long career with the FDNY. 37 years is a long time, but not anything compared to his goal of 50 years on the line. They read that he could have taken other jobs, but he did not want to get stuck behind a desk filling out paperwork. He was a firefighter's brother in the room with him, fighting fires with him. And on 9-11-2001, he's in the South Tower performing rescues with his brothers. Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, you've earned our respect and our ability to honor you. The 
this is my front climb. So I might be a little bit slow right now. But I'm digging deep with the legs. I'm pushing until we get to the top. Because I'm not quitting. Our brothers never quit. So we can't, we can't quit on them. Every brother is going to that top. to carry our brothers to that top 110 story which was the top of the tower that's why we climbed pushing it each and every step digging it deep because that's how we show that they will never be forgotten because we take our brothers vertical we finish their footsteps as they would do themselves this is only a small amount in comparison to the legacies held before us within the 343 each brother will be remembered for who they were and their legacy not only being a firefighter we've had brothers who've gone out to get degrees really good cooks some were New York police officers everybody has a story and it's our goal to keep them alive. Their sacrifice, their legacy will stay alive. And coming up on the last vertical of the county chief, Dennis Cross. This is the last vertical before we get to the 101st, 102nd floor. Talking to you, Dennis Cross. We'll cross that threshold as a 69. All right, we're back. About 30 seconds till this last vertical is over. up right now. 15 seconds. Okay. So here we go. Last vertical complete. two floors battalion chief Dennis Cross battalion 57 the Bedford story lesson section of Brooklyn this is to honor his legacy carry him to the top and I can tell you that we're close we're really close now. Got about seven floors left to go and digging deep on each one of them. Fourth climb of this tour, two yesterday, two today. Coming up on 440 floors. 69 climbs 
so far. And so many more to go. 274 to be exact. Right now I'm working on that third milestone. 75 brothers vertical. Equals the third. And after that, 200,000 stairs have been climbed. Once I reach that mark, around the 80 or 80 second climb. This is pushing it to the limit. For Battalion Chief Dennis Cross. For his wife, Joanne, his firefighter son, Brian, he will never be forgotten. Captain Fearless will live on and on for time to come. The sacrifices made will carry forth. Never forget. a few more floors on this climb for Battalion Chief Dennis Cross, Battalion 57 Bedford Slave Vessel, Brooklyn, is complete. Last few floors, I can feel it coming on. It's coming to a finish. Battalion Chief, Dennis Cross, Battalion 57. We're almost at that, 110. Battalion Chief Cross. Rest in peace, sir. We'll have it from here.